I remember the moment that I realized that I was growing spiritually, mentally, individually as a person. Personal growth was something that I always wanted to attain, just didn't know, you know, the ways in which I needed to make it do what it do. I remember the moments of sitting in silence, being by myself, you know, some of the people that I had been around, it just didn't do it for me anymore. I knew that I was moving towards something different and we didn't have the same path. But I'll be honest and say that many times by myself, I missed just the things that I used to do because there was a certain freedom that allowed me to be in that space. But when you know better, you do better and you don't act upon the things that you used to do. And that's when you know that you're really growing. The things that used to upset me didn't upset me anymore. That was one of the biggest indications. I knew that I was moving into a place where I was satisfied with myself, right? Me came first. I always put others before me. And I always thought that was a good thing, that I was selfless in a way, but not realizing that I was losing a lot of self. Putting people before me meant that I didn't recognize who I was. I didn't know my wants and my needs. I was always catering to other people, so I stopped. Huh, growth is like, it's crazy. I remember that I realized that I was growing when it was easy for me again to put up boundaries and say no like i'm not doing the things that you want me to do i'm doing the things that i want to do because i put me first i remember when i started to employ self-care putting my needs before everything else realizing that i needed to eat well that i needed to read well the things that i was uh taking in and needed to be cohesive to the life that I wanted to live. I remember when I started to mentally prepare myself for just the way in which I was going to navigate through this journey. I wanted to go straight. I didn't want to go left. I didn't want to go right. I just knew that anything out of the path was a deterrence and I just had to travel the way that God had led me to do. I remember the moment that I felt God's presence like alarmingly there. I've always prayed. I've always tried to stay on top of the things that I felt like I needed to do individually in my walk with God. But there was something about feeling God's presence in that moment and knowing that I was on the right path. And for me, that was like the opening of everything that was going to be everything that I needed for myself individually. Like nobody had to be there with me but if God was there reassuring my walk and reassuring my journey I knew that I was there growth allowed me to see everything that I always wanted to see within myself that I was scared to see you know there is a fear that if we show up greater than what we've always done that will be different and people won't want to be around us and the difference in us will cause us to be so much different that we don't even know ourselves but growth is so minimal in the way that it does that it gives us a chance to like keep up and I kept up with myself I kept up with my current self I kept up with my future self I saw things within myself that I didn't think was possible the beautiful thing about growth is that it allows the people who are supposed to be in your now to be there. So many opportunities have opened up. So many people that I didn't think we had a meeting of the minds or even thought of the same things became some of my closest friends and ones that I could depend on and talk to about the growth season and the change that I had within me where they could articulate things with wisdom the way that I needed because see my past self my past self couldn't understand all of the things that was going to be shown to me growth showed me that it is possible to grow it is possible to grow out of your past and out of the past things that you have suffered through or that you have done or growing just shows you that you are on a path of doing what God says you need to do. It is the act of actually showing up for you, for actually putting yourself first, for actually loving every single part of you in this journey. Growth showed me that everything is gonna be okay. 
that I have nothing to worry about, that people, places, and things that were in the past did not make me who I was, but my future self, this present self, the way that I am sitting in me right now matters. I wanted to share this with you because I think that growth is important. It's not nothing to fear, you know? Back when we were young, in the growing, the growing spurt and becoming young children to teenagers and in adulthood, like that was welcome. But there's something about the fear in adulthood of growing beyond what you know for yourself. Take growth by the hand and just let it lead you. Let it show you all of the capabilities that you didn't think was possible for you. Allow growth to introduce you to some things that you didn't even know or even the things that you imagined in your head because you at that time wasn't sitting in the capacity to understand and have all of the things that you needed. Growth allowed me to just be present, be free, be here, be myself. Growth showed me that all of us need to grow. We don't need to stay stagnant. We don't need to go, you know, in circles doing the things that we've always done. Growth showed me that there is something bigger on the other side and that staying in the place where I used to be caused me nothing but friction inside of my heart and inside of my soul. Growth showed me the most powerful part of me. And that's it. So I I hope that you welcome growth into your life because everybody needs it.